Hello, this is a reply to Joe in general, who uh, has done many great uh, cryptocurrency uh, videos, technical analysis within such. I enjoy watching it, and his latest video is uh, talking about exponential Fibonacci, verifying a spreadsheet, and beautifully done. And the answers are correct. Your formulas have been done well uh, this is a full screen so you might have to watch this on a bigger screen yourself I just click on this button here this is a program I made for myself and I'm gonna put the same numbers in but for my I have to put these two zeros in for the rounding purposes so for the key number 66 26 73 52 there's a 66 26 73 52 I got an up target of 114.23, which I see in there as well. And uh, down target, uh, within such, that is high divided by low, the same way to the root of 1.618. And you multiply 1 divided by high. So in this case, 1 divided by 8,700. And then whatever the answer is, to that is the invert of that again. So one divided by all of that. And uh, in this case, it's 4265. And uh, it works really, really well as well. And you're seeing a situation, market goes down, then it goes back up and it's going back down. So this and the, that would be the levels. And it, uh, it, it does the job. And uh, what if anyone's interested in my kind of program, with Windows 10, I put a short key right down here so I can just click on, and I'd click on this off and on like many times a day. And I started making this and I sent the uh, RAR file with the EXE in it, but when I did it to this computer from my other one, it wouldn't open the file. So I, I put the code in, now it does. So what I could do is I could uh, send the code that I have. I have done some uh, mathematical ones like blackjack. I have destroyed. I have totally figured out how to uh, beat the blackjack game on a mathematical level because I've done computer programming on it. Now this is an extremely simple code, just a few lines, but it gets the job done. I could copy and paste this onto, I think it's Small Basics web page. Put a link and uh, you need to have Small Basics. So what I'll do is I will copy and paste this and there'll be a more information box. You can download Small Basic, anyone interested in the program that I use. And there you have it. It would be available. And... Uh, then you put the code in here, save the file, and then run the file. Uh, you'll get an exe point. This is an SB, but when you uh, but when you run the program uh, normally with the exe, it'll come up, and you can just put it on like a taskbar down below here. As far as some interesting other key levels, I'm just going to talk about it because this is an interesting number here at nine percent. 9.0169222 to be more accurate. I'm going to take the uh, first six digits of the Fibonacci, 61.8033%, and multiply it by itself, and that's 38.2. What I find very, very, very interesting is 1 subtract 61.8% gives you that number, as well 68.2% squared gives you that number. I find that interesting. If I multiply this number again by itself, 23.6, which the inverse is 76.4. See, when everyone looks at the Fibonacci numbers, they're just counting down. That's why they probably figure this is a number and not 76.4, when really they, they kind of both are. 14.6 and the 9%, as well as its polar opposites, which is uh, 85, 4, and 91 percent. Mm, I mean, at times they can be useful, and I've used them mainly in like the gold market and anything that has a very high move and a very tiny retracement afterwards. But 
they're not handy. And if you can calculate any other percentage numbers that happen to be dynamite for one level, because one of the ones I'm trying to figure out is so many times when the 1.618s fail, where do I go from there? And I really have a hard time finding that answer. I probably should go 261, but it's... Uh, I've seen so many, like PivX has had a lot of it, uh, just a couple other codes I'm looking at where the 161.8 isn't obeying as you would wish to please. And I know with market general, if you see a move where say, uh, for example, you're looking at a chart, I'm just gonna put some numbers in by random. Um, you're like, okay, it's gonna go, this is one from, it's gonna go to 116 and then boom, it's up to 130, 140. If I see something like this on a chart, I, I know, okay, I, I sold at a much lower price than where it's at now, but I also realize that this is some good movement that I'm liking that uh, should show some good uh, mid-term, short-term potential as well. So I look at the psychology of the market as well as where to place orders and buys. So just going over some of the ways that I'm mathematical level. Uh, so yeah, if you're interested, uh, download small basic you can then put the code that's in the link into this save the file and then you can use it so uh thank you and thank you uh joe for making these videos and uh take care